Are you giving me attitude? No. Okay. No. Andrea might be giving me attitude. Oh, get out of my face! Camera. <laughs> it's doing that weird zoom thing again. I just woke up. Andrea's done giving me attitude. She's gonna make a questionable meal. Yes. Henry just wanted to know if we were gonna go out tonight, and we're not. We're gonna stay in, make the questionable meal. Maybe we'll play some magics, maybe we'll play some video games. Maybe we'll start a new Mario. Sound good? Coffee, uh, taking it easy. I'll edit the video later from yesterday, because I didn't do it in the morning either. So I'll check back in with you when dinner's done. And here it is. This is the questionable, I don't know what to call it. It's pretty much like a lazy man's chili. Lazy man's chili. On rice. Uh, on rice. That's what I'll call it. I put this extra yellow stuff on top because Andre was going to put that in originally. And I don't want to lose that, uh, that crazy yellow stuff. I ain't eating that stuff. I'm going to bed. And now since I don't go to work today, I'm left on my own overnight to do my usual thing of video games and sitting around. Andre was making obscene gestures at me the entire time I was taking that last take. It's now 8 o'clock in the morning on the dot. I spent my night doing my usual thing, video games, editing video, putting up the comic on various other outlets. So, comic 79, page 79 of The Man is up right now. And now I'm going to cook myself some dinner breakfast and then I'm going to take a walk down to the Lacebo, get some booze for tonight, different kinds, something new. I'm going to try to try something new every time, every week, every weekend. I want to make three things a weekly deal. I want to try a new restaurant or some new place in the city once a week. I want to try uh, a new alcoholic beverage once a week. And I want to go to the comic store once a week to see what's there. Uh, even if I don't buy anything, I want to go. It's just an awesome store. It's called Pulp Comics and it's on Queen Street in Niagara Falls. Actually, one more thing I want to do is watch a movie once a week with Andrea. Maybe with the new alcoholic beverage. Uh, but maybe, maybe not, because Andre and I find it really difficult to watch movies for some reason. It's so hard for us to commit to a movie we don't know is going to be good. We don't want to waste our time, and, and we could be doing other things, and we just don't know. And we're the kind of people who, once we start a movie, it feels like we have to finish it, as if we can't turn it off. It's our own problem. We should probably get over it, and I, I really do feel like I'm missing out on one of the biggest mediums out there with the, some of the best content. So I really need to work on that. In about an hour, I will be on my way to the booze store. And I will see you right now. It's uh, 20 below at the moment. Every breath that I take in feels like, uh, it feels a little bit painful. Um, I can feel my nose hairs and my beard forming ice on them. So every now and then I need to go like this to squeeze the ice and squish it so that it can run out of my nose. And uh, every now and then I'll need to brush my beard so that I don't get annoying little sharp icicles on my face. Things I do for alcohol. I'm just dropping those off in the fridge and then I'm going to go back out to the bank and maybe I'll get some groceries depending on how much is actually in the bank. Now I'm back and I did go and get some groceries. I got bread and milk. I'm a provider. I won the bread today. As I was on my walk, I noticed in my reflection that I look like kind of a badass when I have my big puffy coat on. Do I look like a badass to you? No. Well, you know, you know me, so you know I'm not going to look like one, but maybe to strangers, maybe if I, uh, maybe if I scowled more. The way some people look at me is just, I'm either, I either look like some sort of tough guy or, or a weirdo or some sort of weirdo tough guy, or maybe just a weirdo. I don't know. Probably just the weirdo. And now that I think about it for a second or two, I definitely don't look like a tough guy because I held not one but two doors for a little old lady on my way out of the bank. Since I'm not a tough guy, I better accept it and get used to it and start wearing my glasses a little more often. Better learn how to put them on too. There we go. Anyway, it's time for this weirdo to go to bed and for you weirdos to have whales of your days.